up, YouTube babies? Well, we finally got another nice day. It's about 50 degrees and sunny. Uh, and it didn't look good last weekend because we got about three inches of snow. But the motorcycle gods have spoken. So it's riding I go. And this week's topic was something that was weighing heavily on my mind. It's the tendency for us to play the blame game after we make a mistake with our riding or our equipment. You know, like a, a low side or um, dropping your bike in the driveway. Um, and especially when, you know, you're riding in traffic and something happens and you go down, like most of us have or will. Um, there's this mental impulse to try and find someone else to blame for it. Uh, in my case, uh, you know, I immediately realized that I was, you know, it was all, it was all operator error. Uh, but I kept play, replaying the scene over and over in my mind to find out if, you know, maybe I had overlooked something that would make me feel less responsible or less guilty. Um, you know, I even I came up with some really half-baked theories, like I was wearing a liner inside my glove, and so you know maybe I didn't have the same feel for applying the front brake and grab too much because I had too many layers on my hands. That's pretty far-fetched. And you know, it would be nice if I could blame other people, but you know, I was positioned where I was, and it was my own error not to leave more room and there, the roads were clear and dry um, of course in it where I was the road was slick uh, just from age and I know that because uh, my gear was basically not damaged and I slid and the bike slid and and so you know it was plausible but again I have to own that one completely but I think it's interesting that we you know for for a lot of us it may be hard to accept that we just screwed up anyway uh, in in the wake of uh, the Super Bowl uh, it's not uncommon for us to do a lot of Monday morning quarterbacking you know and thinking well what if I had done this or what I guess the most important thing to do is to learn from it. And in my case, I learned that I there are certain things I really need to practice more. And it's important to make sure that I'm aware of you know all the surroundings and uh, conditions, and take my time and back off. And hopefully. If that truism holds uh, about the two kinds of bikers, those that have been down and those that are going down, uh, maybe, and I know this is fantasy, maybe that was the last time it will ever happen to me. And I hope for those of you who have had that experience, it's your last time. And for those who haven't, I hope there's never a time. Although my fantasy about that has now been uh, vanquished. So anyway, it's late winter, you know, soon will be early spring, people will be out, so be extra careful, make sure your gear is uh, up to snuff, make sure your bikes are ready, make sure you're ready, and be safe out there. Happy riding everyone.